probably gonna be my last scan for this show. I'm just, I'm holding strong, same weight, same body fat. So I think it's safe to say that this will be our last body scan before I actually get on stage. So we'll be getting on stage at 12% body fat. Right now, this morning I was 109.8, which is still the lowest that I've seen. I haven't seen any lower. My coach says that once I'm dried out, I'll probably be around 107, 108 on show day. So we'll see. So you guys are here for my last in-body scan, two weeks out from the show. I can't believe it's already two weeks. I'm like, wow. All right, so we are officially two weeks out. Two weeks out from show day. I am like freaking out. I'm gonna take you guys along with me and show you what eating looks like two weeks out. I'm starving, so I need to make this food quickly before I get hangry. I'm gonna try to track on my fitness pal. I'm not supposed to track right now. So I'm not supposed to track, but I wanna show you guys how to track. So I'm gonna see if I can do it on my phone and screen record and then like put it here on the phone with and on the um, video with the app that I use. So I will attempt to do that for you. So here we go. This is breakfast, meal number one. breakfast looks like we've got a third cup of oats with just trivia cinnamon pumpkin pies pumpkin pie spice and my one cup of eggs which I put the exact same thing in just to make them sweet and then my double espresso all right so now I'm going to show you guys how I track the breakfast that I just ate so my calories are going to be anywhere from 12 to 1300 right now um, I actually just got notified though that my coach just decreased my food for next week. So Ryan said run for the hills. My protein right now is in the 160s. Carbs are anywhere from 50 to 60 grams-ish. I think I'm at like 67 today. Fats are around 25. So let's go ahead and track. I use MyFitnessPal. All right, so once you've been tracking for a while, it's actually really easy to use MyFitnessPal because you can just copy, like from a previous date, your foods that you've already scanned or that you've already looked up are saved in there for you. So it's actually really easy. So I'm gonna go to breakfast, add food. I'm gonna scan everything from scratch for you guys. Scan that. I had one cup. One cup, please. One cup. And now, <clears throat> I'm gonna scan the oats. I had one, Louis? One third of a cup. It's actually so easy to use. All right, so that's breakfast that's in there. I do not track coffee. I do not track my sugar-free um, sauces that I use. I will lose those the week of the show, but I don't track things like that that are zero calories. So um, another thing that my coach does not want me tracking is um, our cucumbers or celery. So everything else though, I will track today for you guys and I will screen record it. So that's the breakfast that I just had. And then you can actually click and see the nutrients for the day, things like that, it's so easy. Let's make another cup of coffee. Let's make another cup of coffee. Coffee number two. Coffee number two. Snack time, snack number one. 
I am having three ounces of chicken breast grilled and a rice cake with one tablespoon of peanut butter. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how I put that in my fitness pal. I'm gonna put it on the screen here. So diary, I'm gonna go to snacks, add food. I'm gonna scan my rice cake, one rice cake. I'm gonna scan my peanut butter. It's set, the serving size is for two tablespoons, so I'm gonna do half of that because I'm only doing one tablespoon. And then I have in here already my grilled chicken, so I'm gonna show you guys how it's saved. Three ounces grilled chicken, add. And you can see it adds really quickly to it. So I have my snack right there. Little trick, rice cake in the freezer with your peanut butter like a dessert so I make these the day before and put in the freezer so that I have like peanut butter ice cream I guess I could say all right three ounces we weigh everything three on the money all right a little bit of my barbecue sauce that I always use and that is snack number one Right, it's time to prepare lunch. So, I like to use these zucchini veggie spirals, super easy. Throw them in the microwave for two minutes because you don't want them to be too soft. It's actually gross, like the texture to me. One cup I get of this, heaping cup, whatever. So we get a cup of that. We get four ounces of chicken, which I already had prepared, four ounces of sweet potatoes, and then I add two teaspoons of liquid aminos, two tablespoons of G. Hughes sweet and spicy. Wrong sauce! Oh my god, I almost just died. That would have ruined this whole meal. I thought it was thick. Hold on, take two. That would have literally ruined my whole meal. Not barbecue sauce. The sweet chili sauce, guys, I'm delirious. Sweet chili sauce. Let's try that fucking shit again. That's crazy. Give it a little toss. Realistically, you can just put this in a bowl and put it in the microwave, but I'm a little extra. I like to saute my shit so it like gets all the juices. One of the best parts about this meal, the cashews. Really makes you feel like you're eating like pad thai. So yum. All right, let's go ahead and track this meal. So, screen record for you guys. Let's go to diary, we're gonna go to lunch, we're gonna scan the zucchini, we are doing one cup, we are gonna scan the sweet potatoes, if you scan everything it's so much easier, oh my god, sweet potatoes, I do Now I'm gonna add my chicken that I already have saved in here. Chicken, four ounces. Now I'm gonna have my cashews that I already have saved. You can just quick add them. Boom. Now I am gonna track this sauce for you guys because it does have calories. So let's go ahead and track that. 
We did two tablespoons. Not gonna track the soy sauce, the coconut aminos, cause there's it's zero everything. All right, I've got my zucchini spirals, my sweet potatoes, my chicken, my cashews, my sauce. Good, lunch done. And that took me, how long did that take me? Five minutes, not even? To, not, not even, that took me two minutes to track. So like when you guys tell me like, oh, I'm not gonna track my food, and uh, oh, that is so annoying. It takes two fucking seconds, two fucking seconds to put it in your app and be done. It's just, I don't understand. I just don't, I don't understand. Next set of supplements. I've got my B complex, my curcumin, my L theanine, my DIM, my ADK, and my probiotic, plus vitamin C and zinc. So, I've gotten so good at this. So, I'm gonna enjoy my first form EAA slushy, wild berry flavor, wild berry blast. My favorite, absolute favorite. Why are you laughing at me? Why? Why? I wasn't laughing at you. Why are you laughing, laughing at me? You. I'm not laughing. I don't want to do cardio and you're laughing at me. I can't believe you're going to go take a nap while I do cardio. I know, but I'm going to chill. This is coffee number four, by the way. I'm so fucking sick of cardio. Snack number two. Cardio's done, workouts are done. This is where I hit. It's it's the same trend every day. Like two, three o'clock, I I'm like done for the day. Does anybody care? Yes. <laughs> The saddest thing in the world is gonna be when I lose all my artificial sweeteners. All right, let's track this shit. Let's go to snacks, add food, chicken tenderloins. We're doing three ounces and that is all. Did it add? Number two. I need, I need doubts. Shit. Starving today. Four ounces of chicken, two ounces of avocado, let's put this in my fitness pal really quick. Oops, diary. I'm gonna go down. I'm gonna go down to dinner. Add. We're gonna do four ounces of chicken. We're gonna do avocado. You always make sure that you click USDA avocado. Two ounces. And then I'm gonna scan this guy. And to be honest, I I just do the whole bag because I've added it up and it's basically a cup and I can afford the calories to be honest because it's only 100 calories for the whole bag. 
so I hate the ads on my fitness pal that's the only bad thing about this app all right cool so I have those three things and that's it look at how good these freaking green beans look so you first steam them and then you put them in the air fryer and they are like crispy little french fries so good all right this is dinner we're out of plates so i'm using bowls because i refuse to do dishes right now got my afternoon supplements three of them one ala two cortisol support by first form um adrenal support i'm sorry so let me show you guys what we're looking at we got four ounces of chicken two ounces of avocado bag of green beans that are so good my zero calorie barbecue sauce that i am going to dip the green beans in and then this is from target their sparkling waters are so good and this flavor is divine You thought I was done eating. Last snack of the day, three ounces chicken, one cup of asparagus, and a rice cake with peanut butter. All right, let's go ahead and put this in my fitness pal. All right. So I've already put a lot of these things in today, so they should already be saved in my snacks. I'm going to my chicken, three ounces, add that. I'm gonna go ahead and scan my asparagus bag. Louie, stop. And I'm gonna do one cup of this. And then I'm gonna add in my rice cake. Louie, and my peanut butter. And then we have my snacks for the day. So we are ending at 1,264 calories for the day. So if you felt like I ate a lot today, you probably are under eating because 1,200 calories is not a lot. My protein was at 165. My carbs were, net carbs were, 59 right on the money and my fats were 31 my three ounces of chicken my cup of asparagus and my rice cake all right i am out of calories officially so i am removing myself from my kitchen area because there's nothing else that i can eat today i have my blue light blockers on i have taken my final supplements for the night, my melatonin, my L-theanine, my curcumin, and I am ready for bed. So you guys got to see everything that I ate today, what my diet looks like two weeks out for my first ever bikini competition. I did get notified today by my coach that my food is going to be changing as of monday it will be decreasing again a little bit i'll be going back to like a thousand calories um so if you watched this today and you were like holy shit steph you really do eat a lot you most likely are not eating enough and that could be a big reason why you're storing fat and why you're not hitting your goals like you should be so my biggest advice is always track you guys saw today how easy it is to track it's even easier than i posted because i have all my shit saved in there so i've been doing this for months so it's super super easy i literally can copy from last week i can copy my full day and i don't have to sit there and put things in one by one so tracking your food is super super 
easy you guys just have to get used to it you need to stop being a bitch about it and complaining and just do it so that is my advice for today I'm going to go to bed now so that I don't get hangry in like 30 minutes, but I love you all and I just wanted to say thank you all so much for your support during this journey. I have gotten just an abundant amount of love and support and just an overwhelmingly amount of of positive feedback and positive vibes from everyone in my life that I'm so grateful. It has made me just realize how amazing the people around me are and I am just, I've had a moment to reflect today and I, I'm just so, so grateful for, for everyone that's been a part of this with me. So thank you guys and I love you all and I will see you next time. I don't have a lot of workouts left, so I need to really make sure that I'm putting in the work this week. And this past week, I got back a ton of food, a ton of carbs, so I'm feeling fucking jacked. So, you guys, you guys may know him, but... <laughs>